trends exist on all time spans from seconds or minutes through days, months, cycles to secular trends, often over decades, but they're all history and not a guide to the future. You can see what you want to see in a stock chart or anywhere. And I think trends are a guide to the future. But if you're looking at a, f a trend on a four hour chart, that's not a guide as to what's going to happen next year. That's a guide that, that, that's going to happen possibly over the next couple of days. If you, you're looking at a, you know, a, a, a 50 year chart of gold, that's not a tr an, uh, that's not an indicator as to what's going to ha happen in the next year. You know, that's an indicator of what could possibly happen over the next 20 or 50 years. Yeah, so to conclude, you've got to have, you've got to be looking at the right chart and the right trend for the time frame that you're intending to be trading. It's no, I mean, people do that. They, they'll show you a historical chart of gold since 1763. And, 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 and you're going, okay, that might have some relevance to my entire life not to the next year or three, which is most people's investment. And that's an investment. A trading horizon is like a week, or a speculating horizon is a week or two weeks, and an investment horizon is one to three years. You know, or maybe longer, maybe 10 years if it's property or something. But, but you know, so you, so, yeah, I, I don't know what the purpose of that statement is, but, it, but it, it's... It's annoying. Well, it, it, you just gotta, you gotta, be, you'd be amazed how many people do not look at, a, at, the, uh, at the chart the, that's on the right time scale to the investment that they're making. Why do you think charts give you an edge over the market? I don't think they do. Much bigger edges if you've got inside information or early information. All the I, like I say, a chart just helps me mark my ins and out points and my risk. That's why I'm, I use them more for that than I do for their predictivity, if there is such a word. Uh, predictability. Predictability, there. No, I, actually, I mean predictive, predictiveness, predictivity. Anyway, it doesn't matter. Do you, do you use specific setups with, yeah. to, help, to help you with time frame? Yeah. So talk about uh, I use, I tend to look at a daily chart. I try not to look at charts for more than 10 minutes a day. Try to do my, uh, have my, I just overlook at my positions when I wake up in the morning when I'm having my cup of tea. And then I try and not look at them for the rest of the day. I find the more I trade, the more mistakes I make. And it is tempting though, if I'm sat at my desk writing and I'm a bit bored or I've got a bit of a block or something, you look over the charts and start fiddling. But that's, that way problems lie. Mm -hmm.